Walmart. Come on to the front of the class. We got to talk. Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kanisha, if you're new. This channel is called Lux Living for Less, and on this channel, we try to find tips and tricks on how to still live a fabulous lifestyle on a for less budget. So by the title, you already know that in this video, I am gonna share with you some things that I have picked up from Walmart and some things that are new in store, some stores anyway, and available online that you can use to put together your fall wardrobe. And keeping with the mantra, Lux living for less, Walmart has it down packed. I am shooketh. Okay, I am shooketh at the things I have seen in Walmart over the past month or so. If you have been following me, then you have seen over the past several weeks, maybe about the past month, I have shared with you several try on hauls from Walmart, just did like a shop with me of things that I'm showing you that are in store at Walmart. Y'all, Walmart is not Walmart of yesteryear. Gone are the days of where people used to frown their nose up at Walmart. Now me, I never frown my nose up at Walmart because I wore what my grandma could afford to purchase. I just made it look good. But now Walmart is that girl. So I'm not gonna prolong this intro. I'm just gonna get right to it. Now, some of these pieces I actually have that I have purchased, so I have them here. Some of them I don't have, but I'm gonna share them with you. Some of them I have already ordered. I'm just waiting on them to come. But I didn't wanna prolong this any longer because fall is approaching, albeit we are still in 90 plus degree weather. Fall is right around the corner. And in some places it's gonna arrive sooner than later. I live in Florida, you all know that. So really our fall weather doesn't tend to hit until about maybe mid-October. But for our Northern neighbors, our Midwest neighbors, they may start to feel some of those fall temperatures as soon as the next couple of weeks. So with that being said, let's get started. The first thing that I wanna share with you is by the brand Scoop. It is this pleated handkerchief dress with long sleeves. Y'all, this dress is so good. Now, I did see this dress in one of my stores in Walmart, but it wasn't in my size. So unfortunately, I, I did not try it on because it was way too big, the size that they had in the store. But y'all, I can attest to the quality of this dress because I have seen it in person. I have touched it. I have felt it up, if you even want to say that. This dress looks like it could be in any of your high-end stores for hundreds of dollars. I can definitely see this dress being worn by some of the fashion girlies in New York Fashion Week. This dress is just that good. Now, like I said, it does have a handkerchief hemline, which means it kind of goes up and down like this, almost in a um triangle if you will the sleeves are a little bit looser but the dress is just overall the dress is amazing if you have a walmart in your area go by and check this dress out it also comes in a shorter version as well so if you don't see the long version in your store look for the shorter version it's the exact same dress it's just a shorter versus longer it's it's the quality is the same the material is the same this dress comes in four colors it comes in black it comes in cream it comes in an olive green color and it comes in a pink my store only had it in black which was perfectly fine but i'm telling you this is a dress that you all can rotate easily into your fall winter wardrobe you can wear this dress if you live in a warmer climate like me you can wear it with a pair of open toe heels if you live in a cooler climate when it gets to those cooler temperatures you can definitely throw on a pair of boots with it it'll pair well with any oversized handbag this is just a great dress and the best part about it is it's only $36, $36. Do yourself a favor, check this out. The next thing I wanna share with you is also by the brand Scoop. It is this faux leather pleated halter dress. This is another piece that I have also seen in store. Now this comes in a cognac color and it also comes in a black color. It is a halter top. I saw this dress, like I said, in store. I saw it in both the cognac color and the um, black. I didn't get it because I, I have a lot of leather pieces in my wardrobe already. So I didn't want to rotate another piece in, especially since I live in a warmer climate. It's sometimes hard to get a lot of wear out 
out of your um, fall winter clothes because our weather here is a little fickle when it comes to the seasons. Child, just sometimes it might say winter fall on the calendar, but outside it might say spring summer. But this dress, I have also, like I said, I have also um, saw this dress in person in the store and I am so surprised at the quality of this dress. Now for comparison purposes, I did go to another retailer. This was last season when faux leather was kind of like making a punch in the fashion world. And I went to another retailer, a, a large retailer who is known for clothes. And I saw some of their faux leather pieces in store. They had a bustier, they had um, some shorts and comparing the quality to what I felt then versus this dress, which is priced at $54, by the way. The reason that I didn't purchase from that retailer last year is because I, and I think I even said in a video, it felt cheap. It was almost $200 and it felt extremely cheap. Y'all, I am telling you, this dress by Scoop, this halter pleated faux leather dress, it feels like it could easily be priced at $200 because it is that good. Now, if I were to style this dress, I would wear it with either a white button down, that way you can wear it into the office, or if you wanted to style it for going out at night, maybe a date night, maybe going out with some of your girlfriends, I would probably wear a lace bodysuit and then the halter dress on top a pair of heels, a nice black bag or a brown bag, depending on which color you wear and you have a whole look. And I promise you 100%, if you wear this dress out, people will not believe that you purchased it from Walmart. The next thing that I wanna share with you is a crinkle faux patent leather cropped bomber jacket. Y'all, I saw this in the store as well. It is, it is in this deep, beautiful burgundy color. You, you all know burgundy apparently is the color for the fall winter seasons. The color on this jacket is, is, is very striking personally and it's only priced at $39. Definitely does not look $39. And the best part about this is it has a skirt that is also sold not together, but you can purchase the skirt, which is in the same color, same fabric, same makeup as the bomber jacket. You can pair them together or you can wear them separately. When I saw it in store, I could not believe it because I was like, I was looking around like this cannot be Walmart. Walmart is in charge of the girls this fall winter season. This crop faux patent leather bomber jacket, 10 out of 10. The next few items I want to share with you, I actually have them here. I ordered them online and when I got them in, I immediately went back online for a couple of these pieces and ordered the companion piece and then another piece in another color. Let me show them to you. The first thing that I want to share is this denim corset top. It is by the brand No Boundaries. You can see it does have a zipper at the front and then it has a smocked back. This was only $12.98. Now I did share this with you all when I purchased it. So hopefully you either went in store to take a look at it or you went ahead and purchased it online. But this was definitely, even if you purchased it online, this is a great blind buy item. I mean, look at it. And this is an item, what I like about it is that you can wear it now in the spring, summer months, summer months, or you can easily rotate this into your fall, winter wardrobe. Denim is here to stay. It, it was here yesterday. It's here today. It's going to be here tomorrow. <laughs> so if you are a person who likes to dress per the trends, I got you covered. But this denim corset top from Walmart was only $12.98. The next thing that I want to share is also a corset top. It is the same exact top, but it is in a faux leather. It also has the zipper front with the smock back. This is also by the brand No Boundaries, and it also was only $12.98. Now, unlike the denim corset top, this one may be a little bit tricky trying to wear it in the summertime because it is faux leather. So it does tend to hold a little bit more heat, but definitely something you can rotate into your fall winter wardrobe or if you are an adventurous girly 
you can wear this in the summertime girl and be just fine but this faux leather corset top also from walmart now this next item, I purchased this way back in April and I did share this with you all when I purchased it and I know it sold out quickly. I'm not saying I sold it out, but I am saying it sold out quickly. It is by the Celebrity Pink brand at Walmart and it is this denim jumpsuit. Now, I did a short on this and i got a lot of questions because apparently by the time some people went to purchase it it was sold out now like i said i'm not saying i sold it out but i am saying it sold out <laughs> this halter denim jumpsuit it is long it is not that tall girl friendly albeit in my short i said it was i'm five five i felt like a girl that was five eight could probably wear this with a flat shoe and still be okay five nine and above probably um wouldn't be able to wear this without it being a little short but i'm five five and i can wear it with a flat or a heel and be fine but this has a removable belt also in denim and this was priced at 27.50 but when i purchased it it rang up i believe 17 dollars. so i was very very happy about it it has a hidden zipper as you can see which i love because you know, if you have the zipper that's exposed on denim, it kind of brings it down to a more casual look. But if you hide the zipper, it definitely, you know, makes it to where it looks a little bit more dressy. Now, this has back pockets and it also has side pockets. This is a pretty substantial denim. And even at the price that it was priced at $27.50, when I saw it, I was ready to pay the $27.50, not even realizing that it was marked down on clearance. So I got it totally expecting to pay full price. I will try to find something similar. This also, I believe, came in a pink denim as well. But if this is no longer available, I hope they bring this back, Walmart. If you are somehow watching this, if, if this makes it across somebody's desk who works at Walmart, bring this back. This, this is a good piece. But um, if they don't have it on their website anymore, I will, I will try to find something similar. But I got this jumper for $17 at Walmart. The next denim piece that I want to share with you that I purchased from Walmart is this Jessica Simpson maxi skirt. This is a true maxi skirt. This skirt was priced at $24.50. I got it in a size 14. Now, I did make a short about this when I purchased this. So I did share this with you all when I purchased it. But I said in my short that if they would have had a size 12, then I would have purchased a size 12 because this one is just a little bit too big. It doesn't have a whole lot of stretch, but it has a little bit where it gives a little bit of give. So a 12 would have fit better. This has a raw hemline. And like I said, it is a true maxi. It does have a split in the back. And what I like about this skirt is all of the different washes of denim that it has. It almost, the skirt is off, almost made like somebody um, took a pair of jeans and made a pair of jeans into a skirt. But this skirt, like I said, was only $24.50 and it is by the brand Jessica Simpson. I didn't even know Walmart carried Jessica Simpson, but that's neither here nor there. But got this skirt. From Walmart. Another denim piece that I want to share with you that I purchased from Walmart, also by the brand Scoop, is this denim dress. I shared this with you all as well in a short when I was in the store looking at it and when I was in the dressing room trying it on. I told you all to go get this dress because this was definitely going to be a piece that sold out. This also comes in a cream color. I didn't get the cream color because it didn't, um, in my opinion, look good on me i did try it on i just didn't share it with you all but it is a beautiful cream color so if you want more of a neutral color like a cream then that one is going to be for you now what i like about this is that when you try this on it almost looks like you're wearing two pieces by the way it's, it's kind of cut right here it does have a zipper on the skirt part of the um dress and then it has these buttons here in the top part 
two buttons in the top and then it has like a smocked waistline so it gives you a little bit of stretch this is called the scoop denim shirt dress it was priced at forty dollars in my opinion this is worth every cent of the forty dollars now i will tell you I did try on the 1214 in the store in the dressing room, which is what you saw me trying on in my short. But this dress, she has no stretch. Other than what's in the waist part right here, there is no stretch in the hip area. So you, if you are a more curvier girl like me in the hip and in the derriere, then this may be a little challenging for you. I did go up to a size 16, 18, and although it fit, better at the bottom it was way too big up here so i opted to go back with the 12 14. it doesn't look bad it's not too tight at all but the tw the 16 18 at least on the bottom was a better fit but it was just way 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 too big up here so keep that in mind if you are going to order online or if you go into the store and try it on but this dress is a dark denim i don't i don't it's like a cross between a blue and a black I know on camera it might be coming up black, but it's not a true black. It's like a blue black. Is blue black a thing? Blue black. Now this is, I'm 5'5", five five, so on me this falls almost like a midi length. It does have a split in the front of the dress, no split in the back, and then you can wear any type of belt that you want in the dress or you can wear no belt at all now to to wear this dress you can wear it now with a pair of open toe heels it's probably in my opinion for where i live it's a little bit too warm to wear it now but if i wanted to wear it where somewhere it was going to be cooler at night i would probably wear a pair of open toe heels or in the fall winter season when it gets colder i would probably wear a pair of boots but got this dress, this denim shirt dress by the brand Scoop for $40 at Walmart. The next piece that I wanna share is this skirt by the brand Scoop. So when I ordered this, I didn't have any real expectation, if I'm being honest, on the skirt itself, because sometimes this material, no matter who you order it from, big brand, small brand, fast fashion brand, or a brand in between, sometimes this material can come off a little cheap in person versus what you see online. I got this yesterday when FedEx delivered it. I was so anxious to open it. I opened it immediately. Y'all, when I opened it and pulled it out, I was just like, I immediately went to my iPad and ordered the companion blazer that you can pair with this. They're not sold together, they're sold separately. I immediately ordered the blazer because this skirt is that good. Now it does have an elastic waist line in the back so it gives you a little bit of extra room. And then the rouging that's right here in the front, if you deem your midsection, like me sometimes, to be a problem area, this is gonna hide that for you. It also has a zipper on the side so it makes it easier to get on and off and then it has a little well not a little but it has a split in the front for added little bit of sex appeal y'all the skirt is lined which is an added layer of quality i'm telling you this skirt is so good and y'all this skirt was only 13 dollars 98 cents mind blowing right it comes in black it comes in green and it also comes in this beautiful, beautiful red color. I'm thinking now, why didn't I order the red? I don't know why I didn't order the red. I know why I didn't order the green is because I probably wouldn't have gotten much wear out of the green, but I don't know why I didn't order the red. But for $13.98, I think I'm gonna go back and order it. This skirt, y'all, is so good. Nobody would ever believe that you purchased this from Walmart, much less for $13.98. The last and final piece that I'm going to share with you in this Walmart haul are these cargo shorts. Now, these are also in the same material as the skirt, and this is called Scoop Cargo Shorts. I purchased these online. I did not purchase them in the store, and I ordered a size up only because I wanted the length, and I would just, you know, get it taken in in the waist. So I, I ordered a size up. I would say order your normal size because it is just a tad big. Um, in the back but it has 
cargo pockets on either side and then it also has side pockets and then it also has belt loops so you can wear a belt with it as well now the blazer that i ordered to go with that skirt can also match this now i already know how i'm gonna wear this i'm gonna wear my lace bodysuit that blazer and these shoes right here these y'all I'm try, I don't, and now that I think about it, I don't even think these were $28. I think these were on clearance as well. And I do believe that this comes in, as a matter of fact, yes, they were on clearance because when I, when I saw these, I went back online and ordered them. They come in an olive green. Well, olive green is what they had left. It may have come in more colors before, but now they're only showing black and olive green. I went back online and ordered the olive green in the same short. And I do not believe they were $28. I believe they were $13 as well because I do believe these were also on clearance. 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 Now, just like the skirt, these are also lined. And this has an elastic waistband as well. So it does give you a little bit of extra um, stretch in the back. It has a zipper here with the fish hook close, closures as well. These shorts, people would not believe you got these from down to the Walmart because they're not going to believe I got them from Walmart, especially with how I'm going to style it up. Which, by the way, I am going to be doing a styling video of all of these Walmart pieces coming soon. I'm just waiting for the extra pieces to come in before I do so. That way I could do a complete collective styling video for you and show you how I would wear these and put these pieces together. But trust me when I say these shorts are good, y'all. From Walmart. Well, that is going to be it for this Walmart haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope I gave you some inspiration to, number one, check out your local Walmart, check them out in store, and check them out online, and browse their scoop section in particular, just to see if there's something that strikes your interest. I'm sure from this video that I shared with you and the pieces that I shared with you, that there is something, one, two, maybe all of them, that you have said, I need that. I encourage you to go down to your local Walmart. You can still look really put together. You can still look very luxe, very high fashion, but you can do it by saving money at the same time. You don't have to spend a lot of money to look like you spent a lot of money. If you have to spend a lot of money to feel like you're stylish, you're not doing it right. Stylish and being fashionable are two entirely different things. You can easily buy your way into being fashionable. Style, I think, is in your DNA. But it implies originality and courage. And the worst that can happen when you take a risk is that you fail and you don't die from that. Let that thought resonate. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Give this video a big thumbs up. Follow me on Instagram and TikTok at LuxLiving4 underscore less. And I will see you guys and gals in the next video. Bye, y'all.